Nation, it's your girl Lariah and I am back once again with another video. Today's video is going to be me showing you a natural and simple and affordable look. I'm going to show you the basics and how to just feel good about yourself if you just want to wake up and if you want to put on some makeup. That is okay. Makeup is okay. Okay? <laughs> so, let's get right into the so first we're going to start off by doing our brows. The reason why I do my brows first is because when you use the concealer um, to clean your brows up, it's easier to do the foundation next. That way if you have like a lighter concealer, you can easily hide it with the foundation. If you do a foundation and then you try to do your brows, if you mess up, you're going to have this big thing line of concealer. And when you go to take pictures, it's going to cause flashback. And we don't want flashback. You also don't want to go out and look like Casper at the eyebrows. Eyebrows be on fleek and then you look like Casper because you're sitting there cleaning them up. We don't want that either. No. 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 So, always do your freaking eyebrows. <laughs> so, always do your eyebrows first. <laughs> that way you are aware that when you clean them up, you can always cover it up with your foundation of your skin tone. Boy, if you don't get without further ado, we're gonna start with the eyebrows. So, we're gonna go in with this black radiance pomade. Retails for only like four dollars at Walmart. Whoops, prime the face first, ladies and gentlemen. Make sure you're putting your primer on a clean face. Yes, you want a fresh, clean hand. -made. So I'm going to apply my Sister Skin by Hard Candy. It is new off the shelves. Like, yes, not really. I'm just lying to you. So I'm going to go ahead and rub that in. A thousand wow. years later. Okay, so now the brows. So I'm going to go ahead and go in with my spoolie. That's this thing. It's called a spoolie, if you didn't know. And we're going to brush our hairs upwards. Now, I'm going to go in with my pomade and just dip into this pomade with a flat brush. Looks like this. And I'm going to go ahead and start filling in my eyebrows. So basically, we just fill it in and then we're going to conceal it after we do this eyebrow, that way we're cleaning up all this extra thickness. Like, I like them thick, but <laughs> not that thick. because concealer is our best friend and concealer is gonna help us. So now I'm gonna go with my LA Girl Pro Conceal in the color Fawn. Okay, so we're gonna start off by cleaning the brow underneath. Helga from Hey Arnold. Now we're gonna take a flat brush, looks like this, and we're going to spread the product. Basically, we're just blending the product out. So I went ahead and just blended out some of those harsh concealer lines. I know that they're still there, but we're going to go ahead and put on our foundation. So we're going to keep this video affordable and use our 
Maybelline Fit Me. It retails for about five to six dollars at Walmart. But uh, I'm gonna go in with my Dewy Fit Me in the color 355 Coconut. And I'm going to apply this on my face. Okay, so now that we are dewy and glowy and we're just shining, 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 yeah. Um, we're gonna go ahead and put a little bit concealer right in here to hide the bags and to kind of uplift the cheeks just a little bit, just like to, not too much, just a little bit. So we're gonna go back in with our concealer that we had before in fine and just do a little bit, like three little lines right in here and then blend them out. So next on the agenda is sculpting and contouring. And you can get a three in one from Black Radiance, also at Walmart for about three to four, five, six dollars. Um, they have light to medium and they have medium to dark. And I'm medium to dark if you can't tell. Looks like this and it comes with instructions on where you can sculpt, highlight, and contour. But, uh, I'm gonna do it how I wanna do it. Oh! And we're gonna go ahead and sculpt the areas right in here. Uh, I use powders because powders tend to set more of the the liquids, so I like to use the powders. Sub to you, sis. You don't gotta use the powders if you don't want to. So go in with your sculpt. And you're gonna go right in that area where you just concealed. I like to go on my lids too to give them some, bring them back to life a little bit. So right here. You can go on the bridge of your nose, up to your forehead, just right in there. And then right here. And then just sweep back over this side. Okay, now we're going to go in with the buffing brush and we're going to use it to contour. So our contouring powder is already in here. We're gonna go ahead in and just lift those right from the ear down. Brush your um, hairs here, your forehead line. That way it doesn't look like your scalp and your foundation are like a mask. You know, you know just, it just helps. And then if you would like, you could put a little bit on your nose, just a little. a little bit so now because I had a little bit too much contour I'm gonna go back in with that sculpt and we're just gonna go right under that contour as you can see our eyes look a little naked so we're gonna bring them back to life and we're gonna add some mascara on them I don't know what color, this color. If you see it at Walgreens or Walmart, get this color. 
or there's different colors you don't have to get that color and then i'm gonna add a gloss to make my lips pop and this is the milani gloss and it's in the nude shimmer thingy number two last but not least highlight you want to glow honey you want to show and you want to glow you want to show and glow glow and show so we're going for a subtle look today i don't want to be bold and pull out the fenty we're going for affordable so you can get just as dewy and glowy and looking good with the milani um you can tell i use this a lot because he doesn't even say milani anymore but i promise you it's milani it's in the number four um and we're going to spray our face and then and don't forget to spritz the face i'm gonna go in with my urban decay all nighter spray because we want it to last all day. I hope you guys enjoyed this video just as much as I did filming it. I love to do this for you guys every single time, but without you, I have to hear your feedback. If you like this video, please actually like this video. Give it a thumbs up. Actually, if you could subscribe to my channel, that would be even better. And you can hit the bell so you're notified when I post a new video, which should be every single week, but I'd be slacking because I'm in college. Anyways, I will be getting back on the grind, so work work don't stop it's gonna come and if you enjoyed this video and you found it useful comment this emo emoji down below and thank you guys so much for watching i love you guys so so much xo xo peace